Hi everyone and welcome back to Abby's Digital Nook. I'm Abby and if you're new here I post all things Kindle, Cozy, Kobo, Bookish and tech related. So today I'm going to show you how to create a custom lock screen or custom screensaver for your Kobo. So you just need to connect it to your computer and then it takes a little bit of finagling to find the file but basically all you have to do is select the drive once you open it up double tap or just select and then it's going to open up this page you're going to have to hit command plus shift plus period in order to open up the secret files so once you do that you're going to hit the one that says dot kobo double tap on that and open it up into a new page and then you'll need a folder called screensaver so yours will not have this if you don't haven't already done this i already did this and added my current custom screensaver so what you're going to do is just hit new folder and call it screensaver all in lowercase i accidentally wrote it in uppercase so i'm going to rewrite it lowercase then open up the screensaver folder and drop your new screensaver in there. It needs to be a PNG file. This is what I have currently. I'm going to swap this out for a new illustration that I kind of put together on Procreate from stuff I found on Pinterest. You can have multiple screensavers in this folder and the Kobo will actually just kind of rotate each time between them, but I don't like rotating. So I'm just having only one and I'll switch it out when I decide I want a different one but that's literally it you just eject your Kobo after this and now when you lock your Kobo screen all you have to do is hit the power button and you're going to get a custom screen sofa it's really simple it just takes a little bit of work around but again it's simple so if you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful please go ahead give it a big thumbs up subscribe if you're brand new to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next video very soon thanks for watching bye